The kimono is a traditional Japanese garment and the national dress of Japan. Kitsuke, loosely translated, means to put kimono on. The Kitsuke tent is a popular feature of the Richmond Cherry Blossom Festival. Konnichiwa. My name is Eriko Fukada Sierra, and I'm a teacher at Stevenson Japanese Language School. At the school, we offer Japanese language enrichment programs for children from preschool to high school ages. As part of our school curriculum for all our classes, we introduce and explore Japanese culture. Kimonos are the significant piece of Japanese culture. I'm pleased to share with you today what a kimono is and then show you how to put it on. The model is going to wear a kimono which is called ko furisode. It's a short sleeved furisode for a single woman. The furisode can be worn for many occasions, uh, formal occasions such as wedding ceremonies, uh, graduation ceremonies, and other formal celebrations. So now I'm going to show you how to put the kimono on. The model is already wearing undergarment and tabby socks. Because kimono doesn't have any buttons or zippers, I have to use string to um, put it on, to tie it onto the model. adjusting the length and the width of the kimono for the model. Smoothing the, the wrinkles at the back. Okay, so kimono is put on, so now I'm going to put the sash on. So today I'm going to use this obi, uh, the belt, and tie an elaborate uh, decoration, decorating obi at the back. This is the uh, sort of a hard board so that uh, Ovi doesn't crash down in the front. Obi, again, doesn't have any zippers or any buttons, so we have to use the strings. Now I'm 
just folding and uh, making some pleats so that it looks pretty at the back. This is called obi makura. It's like a pillow so that it uh, uh, keeps the obi higher at the back. And this is to sort of hide this obi pillow because it doesn't look too pretty. So we'll tie it later. And then we have this string and make the last adjustment of obi. First, we'll adjust the, uh, the back side to make sure that everything looks good. And then the front side. Then she will wear this Zori shoes for specific, specifically for kimono. And it's done. In the years prior to COVID-19, teachers at Steveston Japanese Language School have had the pleasure of chatting with Richmond Cherry Blossom Festival goers while dressing them in kimonos. We hope to see you in person in 2023 under the beautiful sakura trees at Gary Point Park. Mark your calendars for spring 2023, where we hope you'll join us in person at Gary Point Park under the Kitsuke tent.